Hello Lola's, welcome back. Today I have baby India with me and she's a cuddle baby so she has like her hands. She does have hands and she has her head and it's silicone. Um, she can take a pacifier. The rest of her body is cloth. Her body, her feet, everything is just cloth. I tend to choose a dark brown body for my most of my cuddle babies regardless of their skin tone um it's just something i like i like it because i feel like sometimes when we undress them it almost look like they have a onesie or something like that um i've been like fussing about people not doing more full body silicone lately or not even i don't paint partials really but i do love them um it's mostly just been cuddle heads but at the same time, I wanted to take the time to tell you guys that I think cuddle babies are very good for a lot of people um, who loves this art. And some people, for a lot of collectors, the main attraction to the doll is just the face. They don't care how the body is sculpted. They're not particular about the hands or the feet. They just like the body. Also, sometimes you love the face, but everything else about the doll, you just absolutely hate and I think this has been a huge um benefit to it when it comes to that because it's like man she surely can you know make a cute face but the rest I just I can't do it um now you just have the face and also for painters I think for us it's so exciting to paint the face when you get to the face um Especially like silicone, you have to do all these layers on front to back because you can't paint it all in one time usually. Uh, but when you do the face painting, you you kind of you spend a lot of time in the face, I think. And I think that is for reborns as well. You spend a lot of time in the face. Unfortunately, some artists, that's all they paint. They spend all the time in the face and the rest of the body is like blah. Um, I've even been to doll shows with full body silicone where the front of the doll is like nicely modeled and it's all beautiful flip the doll over it's like no modeling <laughs> no nothing in on the back of the baby it's just weird um but that's no here and there i just wanted to say also i think a lot of people overlook the fact too that the cuddle babies if they're weighted properly the weight of them the the cuddle factor is just amazing and I think that again I'm not a psychiatrist I'm not you know trying to say that dolls are going to replace you know getting therapy or it treats depression or anything like that but I know um firsthand that the weight of the dolls holding this lifelike object in your hand it triggers some type of positive emotions and I think the cuddle babies be able to do that. Another thing it's also really good about cuddle babies is the fact that a lot of times we're a little on the fence if we're gonna even like silicone, the medium itself, or someone's painting in silicone. Like, is it really realistic in person? Because you hear a lot of people saying, oh, you know, I I I guess the silicone is okay. I guess this is okay because it's silicone and you know silicone don't look as realistic as reborns and all this stuff and I I think to myself it's like huh I guess they've never seen a realistic painting of a silicone baby because silicone can absolutely look as real or more real than vinyl at this age in the beginning when silicone first came out that was very different um most silicone was just blushed and that's it um i think a lot of artists put a lot more work into their silicone now and they've learned a lot over time and i think that there's some amazing silicone pieces of art out here so with that said i think it's like having a sampler <laughs> you get the the cuddle head and you say hmm i don't like it or i do like it and then you go for the full body um, I think it's definitely a transition. It's also the best world of both. Because I'll be honest, even with partial silicone sometimes, I don't like the position of the legs or I don't like the, 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 the 
the elbows or the I mean the arms and all that stuff and um you know just to have everything else flexible and you know just to have the the hands or just to have the head and be able to dress the rest of the baby and it's just nice um for me um vinyl I think vinyl is just as nice as cuddle babies but for me I prefer the silicone as my cuddle babies only because for me I can root my own silicone heads I can't root my own vinyl heads and I just you know I feel like I can actually almost feel like I have a comp a real you know whole baby if I you know do the silicone and I root the hair and all that stuff so it's a little that part is a little different but if I if someone else if I can get the cuddle hair rooted in vinyl and it's a cuddle baby I think I I would still enjoy it just as much um so yeah it's it's definitely you know times are changing I you know like I said I just thought I would point that out because a lot of people are like why even bother with the cuddle babies I think once a lot of people get them you kind of start to feel a little different about it because it's nothing like experiencing something firsthand. Um, I think for some people that's been collecting for a while, they know whether they're going to like them or not um, a little bit. You may, some people may be surprised, but a lot of people, if you've been collecting a while and you just know absolutely, nope, this is not going to be for me, it probably won't be. Um, but I think people, I don't know, like for me, I'm not a person that really loves to dress my babies up all the time. I like my babies and baby stuff like sleepers and onesies and stuff like that. The only thing about the cuddle babies that I forget sometimes is like I've bought um, India about four outfits not thinking that she still have to, even though she has hands, she still need long sleeves versus short sleeves because the cloth will show. So it's a little bit more effort in selecting her outfits but as far as like little pants and her socks or shoes and booties and outfits especially winter time oh my god the cuddles are going to be like the snugglers for me um so right now i think i'm only going to have one cuddle baby which is india i don't know in the future if i will have another that i will add to my my permanent collection um right now I have some cuddle babies that I am gonna like be selling but I don't have that many um I'm actually missing painting full bodies so I'm 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 looking at you know more full bodies and I also have some partials that I need to finish up here that I need to paint I need to 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 get those going but you know I like a diverse co collection, so I like a little bit of this and a little bit of that. Um, it's just something that I personally like. So, just thought I would share. Um, let me know in the comment section if you think cuddle babies are a good thing or not. Do you like them? Do you don't? You know, just curious. Um, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.